Uh, given from behind, they sent on their way from the 2,000 meter marker. Marion aced one of the trailers early on, and Bold Movers also a trailer. Strawberry Pop Tart. Rainbow Row is also right there shortly after the start. Burn Paper Skies going around them, and Consul Queen a good position. Path Tells further back in the run as they settle down, going behind the drill with about 1600 meters to go. Adorable Alley's got about six or seven to go with Dance Team. Rainbow Row is now at the rail. Clouded Leopard also at the rails, got about five or six lengths to make up. And they'll follow it further back in this stage, got about eight or nine lengths to make on them as Marion Hayes. And then we drop back to Bold Movers, one of the trailers, Alabama Slide. And Brave Lass got 10, 11 lengths to make up. But the new favorite is number nine, Adorable Alley. So, Strawberry Pop-Tart takes him to the 1,000-meter marker. Burn Paper Skies back in second position by a length and a half at this stage. In third position is Consul Queen is near the rail. Parkdale pulls off and is going around them with the yellow sleeves and cap. Then Dance Team. Clouded Leopards getting a wake-up call. Got about five lengths to make up. Rainbow Road, Dance Team, Marion Hayes. At this stage, Brave Lass still got about 10, 11 lengths to make up as they move towards the 600-meter marker. And at this stage, Strawberry Pop-Tart has opened up by four. Burn Paper, Sky Parkdale. Adorable Alley's going around them to put in a claim. Consul Queen is towards the inside. Further the back is Rainbow Row. Clouded Leopard is towards the inside. Brave Lass got a mountain to climb. Got about 10, 11 lengths to make up as they turn into the home stretch. And it's Strawberry Pop Tart, the leader. Adorable Alley's making a race of it. Behind that one, Consul Queen. Clouded Leopard's towards the inside. And then Alabama Slide. But Adorable Alley's running strongly. And Adorable Alley's running away from them to win it. Alabama Slide's coming out second best. Consul Queen. Brave Lass takes off late. It will get third and then console queen and strawberry pop tarts. So number nine, adorable Ali Muziani. I think this is his first winner back. There's the salute, the flower alley, wire mowing. For Hassan Adams, bred by Favour Stud, ends up tote favourite at 360, wins by about five lengths, number nine, Adorable Alley. Second, number ten, Alabama Slide. Third position, if we run it across, will go to Brave Lass, and Brave Lass had a mountain to climb, and it stays on for third. Consul Queen, number eleven, is fourth, then Strawberry Pop Tart, further back in the run, Burn Paper Sky, Clouded Leopard, Dance Team, Marion Ace, and then Bold Move. We'll take a look at that short, leave that head on, and here comes the winner, an adorable Ali having its fifth run. And she goes on to score, and uh, Muzi just gets the stick in the left hand, and they run away from the opposition. So number nine, at 360 wins the second until the running of the third race, back to the studio. Welcome back to the winner's enclosure. Number nine, Adorable Alley for the wire mooring stable has come good now. And you're going to just jump in front of the pictures there. Congratulations to the stable. And last time she had excuses. Yes, she did. But you know what? She only came on even better right now. Obviously, she agreed with the poly track, which is really great. Just like to say thanks um, to Hudson Adams and Addison Park, as well as congratulations to my dad and my brother. They work very hard and it's nice to pay off. Clock stopper, travel well. Yes, most definitely. So we can just see what she's all about today. Well done. Thank you so much. Well done to the team. And then we're going to wait for Muzieni to make his return. Much awaited return of Muzieni jumping aboard Adorable Alley. In the meantime, let's do the groom's hand over there. Shadel Naidu from Gold Circle, the 1,000 Rand token to Ernest. There we go. Lucky number nine. So gets the 1,000 Rand token there. And this daughter of Flower Alley, well related, out of the Eliador Mare Red Door, and gets it right at the fifth time of asking. So the result, first number nine, Adorable Alley, coming through to win a good contest. Muzi Yeni, he is on his way back, I believe. So we'll give him a few more seconds. And then once he gets back into the winner's enclosure, 
there. We'll pick his brains. It's been a long time. Patience, perseverance, and you just got to ride the waves there. The good at the bad, and let's see what he has to say about number nine, Adorable Ali. Here he comes, Muzi Yeni. Got his fan club on the left-hand side. They're all cheering. Go, Muzi, go. And let's get Muzi. And that smile is going to be big on your dial. Welcome back. Thank you very much. I'm surprised they allowed me to talk. <laughs> <laughs> now back on your home turf here, coming to the track today. And they obviously brought this one here for the poly to win. Yes, I've got to say to you, I was lucky. I went to track uh, turf 18 in the morning and uh, Mr. Mowing said, please ride these two horses, but this one will definitely win. And I think she'll love the poly. And, uh, she really went down well. She went down like a winner. And uh, obviously, when a top trainer like Mr. Mowing, with so much experience, speaks two weeks, three weeks in advance, then he's got this race for the horse. So I went in with a lot of confidence. And I, I just obviously had to try to beat the draw. And uh, luckily, the speed was quite on. So I was able to file in quite nicely. From there, it was history. I was always double hand full. And I, I just obviously had to ride the confidence that I used to ride with. So just hold them up, and it was a race over. Now, when you come back after a long break, you've got to be patient. you just got to keep your, your eyes on the prize, as they say. And then that first winner backs like your first winner again. Yeah, you know, the trainers and owners might forget, but the fans don't forget. And uh, I got a really warm welcoming when I came here to the course and even in Joburg when I came back. So I think the fans know that I haven't forgot to ride horse. So just well done to them. And a lot of positives were said uh, through my time off on Sporting Post. I just want to say to all the guys who wrote positive stuff about me, I really appreciate it. And to my friend Nalene, who's been quite staunch with me uh, when I was in Durban for a couple of weeks on holiday, looking after me at the shop, just thanks to him. And uh, obviously, I got a new contract, uh, computer form. Obviously, my equipment is not ready. It was a little bit of a short notice. But I just want to say, heading forward, thanks to computer form for the new sponsor. And you gave a few more fans today because you went to a favourite, so you'll have an extra 100, 200 fans. Well done. Yeah, no, 100%. No, it does. Obviously, I had to just give them a pearler, but uh, all the credits to Mr. Mowing and to Mr. Adams for bringing the horse down. Obviously, they'll have to pay their accounts, and it was worthwhile. Super. Thank you. Well done to Muzi Yeni. Good to have him back. So put your hands together. Muzi Yeni's fan club's here. Adorable Ali.